grow up just swimming all the time. Um, but when I started um, swimming in the summer when I was about eight years old, I played every single sport you can think of. I was a cheerleader, I played basketball. Um, I ran cross country, ran track, did the high jump, just did a lot of other sports. And when I got to high school, I really decided to focus on swimming. And I joined a club team um, this summer after my freshman year. And I really just fell in love with the sport. My coach at the time loved swimming. And um, you know, he really helped me become the, the swimmer that could get into a Division I um, swim program. So I uh, know I was never a state champion. I never really made it to finals when I was in high school. But I really love the sport. And um, I love being part of the team. And that's kind of what drew me to um, swimming college. I think for me, uh, being a woman in a sport is, I don't know, really inspiring. You know, you don't really hear all about a lot about swimming unless it's the Olympics. So to kind of be training every single day with a sport that's not as popular as other sports, I know there are a lot of misconceptions. You know, people think, oh, yeah, you know, there's Michael Phelps, Ryan Lockley, they're good looking, they have big <laughs> muscles and all that. But I think as a as a woman and just as a person, it really helps you um, with determination and kind of reaching towards goals and really digging deep in uh, kind of allowing you to see where how far you can push yourself.